welcome back to this match day live post match. It's Friday night. Where would you rather be? In Monaco, watching yes. the yachts? Yes. Or here? <laughs> You'd Monaco. rather be here, wouldn't you? Of course. Okay, well, yeah. you are, of course, ringing us here in the studio. Thank goodness we've got you guys out there to speak to her, else we'd all be in trouble, wouldn't we? Family from Northern Ireland has decided to give us a call. Hello to you. Good evening, Haley. Good evening, lads. Hiya. Bye, mate. Uh, just a couple of wee points tonight. Uh, first of all, I think uh, we're all in agreement that we did this striker situation address before Monday. And yeah. the midfield, uh, a lot's been made of Ronaldo's absence. Uh, Michael Carrick, very important player for us last season. I think if he'd have stayed on the pitch for the duration of the Newcastle game, quite possibly three points, badly missed the night too. Just like hear what you think. Yeah, because we are missing Carrick. Hargreaves and Ronaldo. It's not just about the fact that we haven't, you know, got Ronaldo. There are a few players who are who are missing at the moment, and mm -hmm. Carrick is one of those very important players that you like to have in the side, especially Definitely. at this time of the season. You're starting things off and want to continue that yeah, momentum. Yeah, I think with Carrick in the team, you know, maybe gives the goals of that a um, little bit more room to get forward. Mm. Um, but yeah, Michael's a fantastic player. Um, great pass for the ball. Um, keeps things simple. But um, yeah. He, He's another player that's, you know, missed as well because, um, you know, Anderson's only come back from the, from the, um, the Olympics. Um, he's not had a summer off. No. So, um, you know, what we don't want to be doing is playing him week in, week out because obviously he'll burn out as well. Mm. So, you know, you'd like, um, you'd like Michael to be back, definitely. Yeah, OK, well, thank you for that point, family. Have you, did you play with anybody who suffered from um, tendonitis at all? Owen Hargreaves' injury at the moment? Um, I think Ollie did add it, didn't he? Yeah, is that yeah. his knee? That's his knee, yeah. So, um, you need soft... You, I mean, probably the pitch tonight was too hard for him. Yeah. Because um, it is it's to do with, you know, the hard pitches and stuff. Fingers crossed he can get it sorted because um, mm. he, he is another fantastic player who we need fully fit for the season ahead. Yeah. I played with somebody as well, Gordon McQueen. Uh-oh. You know, don't you? I heard he was rubbish. <laughs> no, always <laughs> injured, you know, <laughs> complaining of this and that and tendonitis and something else and uh, you just couldn't get them to get out in that pitch. That's terrible. You're lying. No, I'm lying. <laughs> <laughs> I'll tell you what was different. They used to eat a bar of chocolate before they went out into that pitch. I know my dad did. He had a, he'd have a bar of the uh, purple and white stuff. Turkish delight. Cadbury's, <laughs> if we're allowed to say it. He would. He'd have a huge bar of Cadbury's and go straight out and that would be him. Probably an, another one at half time as well. So, <laughs> slightly different to the yes. modern day when uh, they have. Are you Cadbury's? Yeah. Your chocolate now. <laughs> yes, please. Okay. 